Hmm? I do. Speak up. This is this is the time now. What do you guys think about this? <laughs> it's the body. It's our church. It's. <laughs> I think that, you know, during the episode, mm-hmm. he is walking alongside. Mm-hmm. And, like, for instance, when I have a friend who's eating because they've lost a friend, mm-hmm. you walk inside mm-hmm. and you listen. Right. And you, they, they have mm-hmm. to tell the story, and they have to tell it, like, a hundred times. Right. Mm-hmm. And you listen, and you reflect back mm-hmm. at, to them what they're saying and how they're feeling and you're praying for them, and you're, maybe you're cleaning their house, or maybe you're taking you know, them to the grocery store, maybe, because they can't even get out of the house, mm-hmm. or just to, grief is hard, or, yeah. right? Or maybe so, you are just listening. Right, and, but it's whatever is needed in that moment, you know? yeah. and, and walking alongside, I think that's, that's what I envision in my head when I think of bearing the burden, is being in it with them, yeah. but not being. <laughs> Helping to relieve some of the pressure. Being in it with them, but not being in it with them. You know, like not yeah. have, you know, not being affected by it to the degree that it's moving you. Right. But you're shedding light. I think that's actually, so, if you look uh, at the root word of heal, 